Season one, we knew we wanted to have a main title sequence. I do think we had an idea of contrasting propaganda, but this thing came in almost fully baked from Elastic. They captured the whole idea and feeling and concept of the show, which is, you know, really more than you could ask for. So a title sequence is really like the prelude to the beginning of a show. So really the challenge for us is to make a title sequence that is engaging, but also not too distracting and not too boring. We plunged into research, you know, looking at art, looking at posters, looking at propaganda, looking at statues, and just kind of just grabbing it, not necessarily having any kind of uh, limitation of what we're pulling. And then when we pulled that all together, we connected the dots. All our talk about how all these differences are really just mirrors. They found a way to blow that up visually. And I think that's where the whole uh, bisecting of the frame came from because we wanted to show like, you know, this is one side of the world, how they view things and this is how we view things, but there's some striking similarities to them both and there's a relationship there. And I think that tie, that string of narrative is what we want to say about the characters in the show with the statues, just their poses are strikingly similar. The only difference is just like the symbols that they're holding in their hand. Stripes, stars, and like they have their own symbolism to us as well as like what they have in their, in their posters. And you know, cause their stuff is really directional. What I liked from that was all the energy. I think what drove the typography was mostly the propaganda posters. They were very straight, bold letters, and we were trying to find a font that kind of married the two sides. Like, you couldn't tell if it if was from an American poster or from a Russian poster. We found one, and it's called Russo One, and it's funny because it's built from Russian letter forms. We come up with these ideas, and we pull reference, and we put some imagery together. We can use any of the imagery that we had pulled as reference because everything comes with a rights issue or a usage issue. So the guys had to then set about almost recreating originals of all the images that we wanted to put into the title sequence. And we just started doctoring up some things, like this is the original, and we put the character's uh, photo there and just make it feel like there's an impression that we're kind of doctoring these documents. Mm -hmm. Like those spy movies, you just ha you have a lot of information coming at you. It's almost like a visual dossier of each character, I think. The thing about the Americans title sequence is you watch it and you blink and you miss it and you're like, I gotta watch that again. You wanna watch it a thousand times. Each little piece is interesting. It also has depth and complexity. We've been doing the show for six seasons and we still find new things in the title sequence.